In this demonstration, we'll show how DataWalk can be used to quickly identify and investigate procurement fraud. We start here on the DataWalk Universe Viewer, which provides a visual representation of all your data and the connections between data sets. Via the Universe Viewer, you can import and structure your data, configure and check rules and scores, and alert on any desired condition. DataWalk can handle many billions of records, though in this case we have just a small sample of fictitious data representing ERP, orders, supplier data, and data from our HR system. DataWalk enables you to easily supplement your data via external sources such as social media, sanctions lists, or the Panama Papers records, which were downloaded from the Offshore Leaks database. Each icon represents a data set, and at any time we can view and manipulate the underlying data via table view, and the lines indicate cross-references, or connections, between those data sets. The data structure shown on the Universe Viewer is customized for each implementation, typically in hours or maybe a few days, and then your administrator can further extend or modify this structure if desired. DataWalk provides a unique risk scoring capability which can be used to identify the contractors, employees, and business events which may be associated with procurement fraud. Analysts can easily define scores using expert rules, machine learning models, and or social network algorithms. As an example of how to create an expert rule for a score, I'll select the sanction list and then select the associated contractor set, where I see that 20 of our suppliers are on the sanction list. I can further filter the data to only see those who are notified by a whistleblower in the past, and now we see five results. I save this, giving it a name of Contractors on Sanction List Notified by Whistleblower, and my rule has now been created and saved. Now we can easily add this new rule to our score with just a few clicks. On this particular list, we see a definition of a score which consists of expert rules that were previously generated by an analyst, social network rules which are calculated automatically in DataWalk, and machine learning results derived from Python or R. And we see the weights assigned to each. We choose our new rule, assign order weight, give it a name, And after a few seconds, a new score has now been generated. The higher the score, the higher the risk of fraud, so we now investigate one of the highest scoring contractors. We start here on the DataWalk Workspace panel, which shows available scores and rules. And by the way, here you can also easily configure alerts. As an analyst, one of my buttons is My Cases, and here we see a list of the contractors that I've been assigned for verification. I take the highest scoring contractor, the BCM company, and here we see a summary of key information about them. Their score value is triggered by a combination of expert rules, machine learning, and clustering. We can quickly see which rules were triggered with this contractor, such as contractor on sanction list, or reported by whistleblower in the past, and so forth. In this case, we've also configured suggested forensic actions considering the rules that were triggered, and here it suggested that we should import the whistleblower report details. We see that contractor BCM was included in a suspicious cluster which was automatically calculated in DataWalk. We can take a look at this cluster on a link chart, and we can instantly see indications of a procurement fraud scheme where two companies and one employee share common bank accounts. If desired, the same calculation could be performed for addresses, phone numbers, and so forth. Earlier DataWalk provided a recommendation that I should import and verify whistleblower report details. This report was scanned and converted into a PDF, and I drag and drop this PDF onto the canvas. DataWalk provides a variety of capabilities to enable analysis of text content such as documents, emails, and social media excerpts. You can easily utilize entity extraction to automatically identify and categorize key terms and objects. We see that a whistleblower claims that we're dealing with a bid suppression scheme involving collusion between BCM and a competing company called Techman. We search for Techman directly from the text, and we add it to our link chart. Now we want to identify any connection between BCM and Techman. To do that, we use an intelligent find path capability, which enables you to determine any possible indirect connections between objects without knowing exactly what you're looking for. We select type of path, which is shortest path, then range of data, and next we can select the maximum length of the path, 
where I select three hops. Finally, I'd like to see only new connections hiding other parts of the graph. We instantly see that BCM and Techman are related indirectly through IP addresses being used for login to the tender system. At the same time, we've identified wider potential fraud structure involving other contractors. We can now add this finding and create a final report with associated analyses, files, and notes. So in this demo, we've shown how DataWall can help you identify and investigate procurement fraud by bringing together all your data, easily creating and modifying rules and scores, leveraging external data sources, and automatically identifying and visualizing clusters indicative of suspicious behavior.